Hello guys, welcome to Geospatial Theo. Today we give special emphasis about zonal statistics. As usual, let me remind you to subscribe my YouTube channel and to gain some kind of updates from my channel. Hit the bell and you will get uh, the updates. As you know, zonal statistics means one of the statistical parameters that help us to calculate a values of raster data set with a given uh, boundary or a given uh, zone. To perform uh, special uh, analysis of uh, zonal statistics, I have prepared two kinds of data. The first data uh, that I have prepared is the shape file or the administrative uh, boundary. This is uh, found in Amara Regional State of uh, East Gojam Zone. This East Gojam Zone contains about 18 uh, waradas. And the second data that I have used for this practical exercise purpose is soil chemical property of the zone. This soil chemical property is the pH value. This pH value indicates, uh, indicates that whether the soil type which is found in East Gojam zone is acidic or neutral or alkali. So, uh, Based on this, we can identify the area which con we can easily identify each word as contribution in terms of strong acid, moderate, uh, moderately acidic, neutral, strongly alkaline, and uh, moderately alkaline. So we can uh, calculate each five categories in terms of hectare. This red color indicates that strongly acidic soil. So this strong acid contribution in this water is this much amount of hectare. So to uh, easily calculate the contribution of each uh, pH uh, value in a certain geographic area, we can use this uh, sonar statistics. To do so, what we are going to do is uh, go to Arc Toolbox. From Arc Toolbox, we have uh, different tool sets and we are interested to use spatial analysis tool click here from the list of tool sets we are uh, going to use zonal from zonal double click on tabulate area double click here so input raster or feature zone data is east region zone or the vector data from this uh, we are very much interested to calculate uh, the pH value or the pH level based on the Worada. So select Worada name. The input raster or feature class data uh, is the raster data or the pH data. So uh, this pH data have two columns. The first one is value, the second one on this category. Let me use class and we can uh, see it, our working directory and we can give uh, the table name but I would like to leave uh, the default geodatabase so click here this is a tabular area that indicated that all administrative boundaries or all administrative borders have its own strong uh, strong acidity, moderate acidity, or a pH level of uh, that uh, soil type. So let's open this, right click, open. As you see, here is the water name, which is found in East Gujam zone. There is an added, Awabel, Basoliban, and the like. This indicates that the contribution of strong acid in uh, an added uh, is this much amount of meter square, uh, moderately acidic, neutral, and moderately alkaline. This indicates that strongly alkaline. So the total area of an added is the byproduct of strongly acidic, moderately acidic, neutral. Uh, moderately alkaline and alkaline so what we are going to do is let's copy these two excel sheets to make copy here there is the option click here go to select all click here 
all the records are selected to copy what we're going to do is go to here and make right click copy selected then minimize this open excel data excel let's paste here okay this is a zonal statistics that is originated from uh, the raster data sets so uh, under the road that have uh, this much amount of strongly uh, acidic soil mm -hmm. this value indicates that meter square but uh, i need to convert this meter square to uh, that of hectare so uh, to convert this what we're going to do is let me uh, rename this strongly acidic so the value of strongly acidic is equal to this number this meter uh, square over 10,000 because one hectare is 10,000 uh, meter square so double click here this is all the value of strongly acidic copy let me paste here the value let me change the moderately acidic moderately acidic the same formula is applied is equal to this meter square over 10,000 then double click here let's copy this and let's paste the value for neutral is equal to the same formula is applied for all the parameters over 10,000 let me double click here copy this then copy value for the sake of moderate alkaline is equal to this value over 10,000 then double click or drag like this then copy this let's get and paste the value the final one is alkaline is equal to this value over 10,000 then okay let me copy this and paste value this is all about the zonal statistics value that is originated from the raster data set The next thing that we are going to do is let us uh, take the area of each right click here, open attribute table. This is the Worada name, but I would like to calculate the area of each Worada in terms of hectare. To perform that, go to table option, then uh, add field. Field name is area area in hectare because the zonal statistics that is original from raster's uh, data set is converted to uh, in terms of or expressed in terms of hectare and i would like to do the same unit here so double is uh, the data type make it okay to calculate to calculate the area of another and uh, however or 18 or others go to area and hectare and here right click calculate geometry hit ok then area this is the projection type that we have used so the unit should be hectare make it ok yes this is the total area of 
the each respective water does this amount of hectare for instance uh, another have uh, 67,942.14 hectare of land so let us uh, copy this right uh, go to table options select all and uh, right click here copy selected then go to the excel sheet and let me paste here so i need only the total area of the world this is another and this is another all are similar let's remove the rest okay this is total area total area then let's uh, make the decimal unit into two go to format cell number then decimal places to hit ok ok so the next thing is we can easily calculate the percentage of uh, strongly acidic moderately acidic neutral moderately alkaline and alkaline so what we're going to do is percentage of strongly acidic percentage if you are interested to calculate uh, the percentage this is 100 percent and what uh, what about this much so is equal to this strongly acidic times 100 over total area this is the formula so this is strongly acidic let me click here and right click format cell go to number the decimal place is two so the percentage of strongly acidic in another order is 27 percent all our Water have six point two percent of acidic soil or strongly acidic soil. The largest uh, is sixty six point five six Debra Marcos. This area have largest amount of acidic soil. If you are interested to calculate the percentage of moderately acidic soil, the same thing is happen. Moderately acidic percentage is equal to this number times 100 over total area so double click here and let me round the decimal place into two so about 41 percent of our uh, dororada is uh, characterized by moderately acidic soil the same uh, fashion all the percentage distribution of strongly acidic moderate less neutral moderate alkaline and the strongly alkaline soil distribution can be calculated with a similar fashion this is all about the general statistics if you have any question please welcome have a nice day